Well, hello, hello, all my amazingly beautiful Scorpio friends. My name is Libra Empress, and we're going to be discussing your tarot for today, all right? Now, remember that this is a general reading, and this is for yours as well as for my entertainment. And also, please don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and share. That way, you'll always be up to date with the content that I produce, and you'll be a part of our family, all right? All right, let's get going, shall we? Now, my beautiful Scorpios, we've got three piles here, past, present, and future, and clarifiers attached to each of them. And we're going to go through them together, okay? Now, when we get to the future part, remember that it is not set in stone, okay? You can change your future however you like, whenever you like, okay? You have a choice in the matter of where you're going in regarding your destiny, okay? That's just how it is. We were given free will. Now, let's get going, shall we? Now, my beautiful Scorpios, your past energy is the Ten of Swords. So you were fighting everybody off, trying to keep what was yours, and everybody was trying to take and take and take from you, all right? It kind of reminds me of the story of the Foolish Knight, where the Foolish Knight was trotting along and you know on his horse, and he was ready to go, and people kept stopping him and asking him for stuff. It's like the first one's, oh, we, we need um, food, so he gave away his food. Well, we need money for food. Okay, well, he gave his money away for food to the next set of people. Then we need armor. Okay, we'll give you your armor away. Well, then um, we need clothes. Okay, well, here's your clothes. Well, we need a horse to ride. Well, here's your horse to ride. And he gets to the forest and he continues on in. And he gets stopped by a bunch of um, cannibals. And they go, well, we're hungry. So guess what he does? He gives up his whole body and nothing's left except for his head. That's why he's called the Foolish Knight. Okay? So you were given more than what you were needing to give. Okay, you're sacrificing and fighting for your shit. Words were exchanged. You or they said something that they can't take back or you can't take back. Okay? It's like this. You always think about how you're going to say it and what you're going to say to who you're going to say it to. And you can catch more bees with honey than with vinegar, but in this case... You know, you lost a whole relationship, you know, it's, but it's for the better, right? Let's find out. A tower, you got a tower card, which means that your whole reality was shooken up by a, an enormous event. And it might have been for the better, but it might have been for the worse. It's all up to you on how you take it. You can see the world, you know, the glass is half full, where you have possibilities and, you know, you're able to fill up your glass. Or you can see it as half empty, where nothing's able to situate, situ situate your cup. I've been doing readings all night. I don't know how to talk, apparently. So, it's something like that, alright? But, ultimately, you were able to find help, right? Get your three coins. There was, there was a beginning somewhere in your past. It wasn't a permanent... It, it definitely it wasn't meant to hold you back in any way, shape, or form. So currently, Scorpio, you are the Page of Wands. Or at least your energy is temporarily, alright? What this means is that nothing's holding you back from your dreams. You will get up and you will accomplish them. Okay? Yes, you're a little confused on which way to go, all right? You have to step into emperor mode, okay? You you brought order out of chaos. That fucking tower, the, the chaos before in your past, you put an end to that shit. And you are safe within your bomb sh shelter with, you know, your family, friends, and your sweetheart if you have one, okay? Because the world's gone nuts outside, but everything's okay with you on the inside. Now your possible future. Your main energy is the Three of Cups. You're getting married. Starting new beginnings. Having a baby. Starting a new endeavor, right? Any of those really can ring true to where you're going. You kind of went in a hermit mode, okay? You're trying to pamper yourself, take care of yourself because you deserve it, okay? You've had one hell of a road so far. You are beginning the fool's journey all over again. You have hope, a pep in your step, okay? You know that there's a new beginning, and you're calling judgment 
on a past scenario and moving forward with your life and that's why you're the in the full order is because you know that there was an ending to that and you took responsibility for your actions and you understood where you stood and where they stood and you're moving forward to to better days okay so you have a really good reading um thank you so much for listening to me my beautiful scorpios know that you are not alone in this journey and it's it's a little bit hectic but you're you're overcoming a hell of a past like and you're moving forward and you're pampering yourself you're doing you i'm so proud of you i love you you are so special in every in every way possible all right things good things are coming to you because you've been such a good person that's why i always call y'all beautiful souls because i'm calling or if i say you know you're beautiful my friend i'm not talking about your exterior i'm always talking about your interior all right you're ever evolving now you're gonna have a great day today i love you please don't forget to hit like subscribe and share and join me again for next or tomorrow's daily horoscope or next time's tarot love you bye scorpio